Hey what's up everybody? Today we're diving into the highly anticipated Nikon Z8. Are you ready for the ultimate review? Because I sure am. Let's jump right in. First things first, let's talk about the Nikon Z series. Now, if you're a fan of the Z9, you're going to love this. The Z8 is like a mini Z9, packed with incredible features, but in a smaller body and at a more affordable price point. Plus, it's coming out on May 25th, 2023, so mark your calendars. Alright, let's break down the pros of the Nikon Z8. First up, we have AI autofocus with deep learning. This means you can capture those fleeting moments with precision and accuracy. Trust me, this feature will blow your mind. Next, we have the body and design. It's weather sealed, so you can take this bad boy out in any conditions without worry. Rain, snow, or shine, the Z8 will have your back. And it also has a sensor cover, so your sensor isn't exposed without a lens on. Oh, and did I mention the illuminated buttons? Yeah, you heard that right. No more fumbling around in the dark, trying to find the right button. The Z8 has got you covered. And here's the cherry on top, the Z8 features the same image sensor as the Z9. That means you're getting incredible image quality and stunning detail in every shot. It's a game changer folks. Now, the ISO range stayed the same, and that's not a bad thing. Trust me, you'll have plenty of flexibility to capture those low light scenes without sacrificing quality. Alright let's talk about the cons. Now, the price tag might not be for everyone, but hey, it's definitely better than the Z9. So if you're looking for that high-end experience without breaking the bank, the Z8 is a great option. There's only one CF Express XQD card slot, which might be a drawback for some photographers who require multiple slots. And unfortunately, there's no mechanical shutter. But hey the pros definitely outweigh the cons here. Now let's quickly compare the Z8 with its big brother, the Z9. Size and weight-wise, the Z8 is more portable, perfect for those on-the-go shoots. And while both cameras have incredible autofocus, the Z9 edges out with better low-light performance. When it comes to video recording, the Z9 supports unlimited recording, whereas the Z8 is limited to 90 minutes. And let's not forget about battery life. The Z9 has a larger battery, so it'll keep you shooting for longer. Now, let's talk price. The Z8 is less expensive than the Z9, making it a great option for those who want top-notch features without breaking the bank. Overall, the Z8 is a fantastic camera that brings professional-level performance in a smaller, more affordable package. So, there you have it. The Nikon Z8 review in all its glory. If you're in the market for a high-end mirrorless camera, the Z8 deserves serious consideration. Don't miss out on this one. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep capturing those epic moments. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and comment down below if you are trigger happy to buy the Mini Z9 and how are you planning to use it. Let me know below.